Hello everybody, how are you? This is Etsy from Pegaso Gaming 956 and today I'm going to bring you something that since the beginning, uh, if you will remember my first video, but I wanted to have and it's ready to work. Um, we, I have added thanks to the people at FIFA Mexico forums, I uh, was able to add with their patch the Ascenso MX, so it's just gonna be part of the of the Tigres career mode series uh, however that will be narrated in the Spanish language and, and uh, I think also before I go on I just wanted to explain why I stopped uploading videos to my channel and first of all I had a I was having problems with, with my video card. It would uh, it would start to glitch out and it would lose frame rate while recording. And uh, I, I think now that I, I got it fixed uh, for the most part. Or, and also, you know, uh, schoolwork started it started to get uh, you know a little bit harder, so I had to put more emphasis on that. Uh, but hopefully now in the second semester. Um, I'll have uh, more time, you know, to be at home and uh, be able to upload, you know, to more videos to the channel. So let me talk a little bit about the patch that I have installed in, the, in my FIFA 15, which as you can see here is working. It, it is created by user JS uh, hunger. Uh, JS121 of the FIFA Mexico.net forums uh, well, and the patch includes Ascenso MX and uh, Copa MX uh, as well as it has the uh, it's pretty much uh, has the latest uh, squad updates you know transfers and everything as well this like I said Ascenso MX uh, which is playable in career mode uh, to have the promotion towards the Liga MX. Um, it also contains the uh, Copa MX uh, and I'm reading the description here and it says that it is playable in career mode um, and it features eight of the eight best teams of Ascenso MX, four best of the Liga MX Apertura and four of the Clausura that play in the Copa, but unlike real life, um, the Copa MX is, is a year-long uh, year uh, tournament head. as well as uh, Ascenso MX. So Ascenso MX will not be uh, Clausura and Apertura, I guess to simplify things. And uh, it also, so the, the two best here. teams, you know, the ones who make it to the final, the Copa MX will win Rios. the the pass to play the Copa Libertadores. Um, oh, um, uh, it it also uh, contains the um, the UEFA Champions League. No, no, sorry, not UEFA. The Concacaf Champions League uh, for, for for in the patch. Um, it's, uh, and I think that's that's pretty much it as far as major major uh, things that the patch contains uh, like I said I, I gave I'm giving this right now a try in uh, kickoff mode uh, I have yet to uh, deep uh, well not deep but to uh, give it a try in in a career mode uh, before I start uploading the videos you know just to check that every tournament is there available to be played and make sure there are no bugs uh, as far as the uh, classifications of, of the tournaments uh, but like I said the teams most of them you know they have their, their kits the players and uh, and that, that, that'll be it uh, I plan to make this uh, a really immersed uh, his uh, story for for this career mode. Uh, I'm actually ch I'm actually trying to get some uh, green uh, poster boards and act like kind of like a little fake uh, green screen 
and just to try to uh, immersify myself, you know, into the life of an actual manager, you know, with the and here's a goal from uh, El Siempre Capitán Junino. Um, anyway, back to our, to where I was going. Um, my plan is to, you know, have um, you know some cutscenes with with me on it. Um, with uh, also, um, what can say? Oh yeah, yeah. Press conferences. Uh, press press conferences um, with uh, you know some questions that you guys might have uh, in the comment section, or if, for example, if they do like if EA Sports, you know how they have their little press releases, and they they you make you have to make you make a comment on the other team, your own team, or a specific player. Uh, you know, just to specify this is something different. I don't think I don't think I've seen something like that in any other YouTube channel. Uh, maybe I'm wrong, but or, or all, yeah, most of that I've seen, I haven't seen it. So uh, hopefully you hopefully you'll be able to enjoy it. Uh, right now, uh, I'm pretty sure some of you are asking if I will be able to uh, do. How is that not a foul? Sorry. It's just that it's just like the Guerrero totally just went past score. him, and the the guy, you know, slid, uh, didn't touch the ball, and he fouled Guerrero, but yet the linesman didn't call the foul. But anyway, it was the end of the first half. So, anyways, uh, back to once again back to where I was uh, heading to. I know some might be asking if I will do videos on FIFA Ultimate Team. And uh, my answer is, uh, for right now, oh, I do not plan to uh, to upload any Ultimate Team videos. When I goal. played uh, on PS3, I personally didn't like Ultimate Team um, because you had all, you had all all these players, you know, with you know with super. It's, they always had like super PC super PC players, and I was never good actually at auction. So I would never, I wouldn't have enough coins to buy really good players, and I'm not, I don't want to, I don't want to bore you with seeing, oh, loss after loss after loss after loss. So my my focal point in this channel will be just uh, career mode of videos. Uh, also, some of you might ask what happened to the um, Newcastle United career mode videos that I had uploaded um, I don't remember if I if I went over it but anyways uh, I had some you know had the glitches with the uh, with the the video card so I didn't uh, do any more videos and uh, when I uh, uploaded, when I installed this patch, this uh, sensor analysis patch, another penalty. Hmm, oh interesting. Uh, when I uploaded, when I put this patch into the system, uh, it was a brand, it was a brand new uh, database to handle all the new players, new teams, and everything that was installed in it. So, because of that, the squad's file became corrupted, and I had to delete it. Therefore. Uh, because that the database that was used for the career mode is non-existent, it causes it's gonna it caused the game to crash. So it's pretty much rendering uh, it useless now. But what I'm going to do is uh, upload, uh, restart the, the story, the Castellano story. But uh, now that I have you know the Tigres thing that will be my main focus Again, but I will I will upload like I said the Newcastle United story and that will be uh, narrated in English while the the Tigres um, New, uh, New, 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 Newcastle while the Tigres story will be narrated in, in Spanish for all my uh, all my uh, Tigres and uh, Liga MX fans uh, that I have uh, befriended, you know, on Twitter, on Facebook, and everything. That way, they can they can enjoy uh, something different, and 
Hua uh, because some of them aren't um, English speakers. So anyway, this is all I have uh, for today. Uh, just a little heads up of what's coming in for my channel. Um, once again, you know, if you like YouTube videos and everything, uh, be sure to like like this video and subscribe if you haven't done so already, uh, so you can get notifications on when I upload this, these videos as far as the Tigres career mode or the Newcastle United so career mode. So hope to see you uh, next time on this channel. Have a great day.